Hi guys, welcome back to Martial Art Tutorials. Today I'm going to explain a video. This video is going to be dedicated to Bobo Morgan. This username, this YouTube user and I were having an argument on the internet because he basically said that my sparring video sucked because I was blocking some kick with the palm of my hand. And I want to explain to him and to everybody why is that. It's based on physics, the second Newton law, which is acceleration is produced when a force acts on a mass. The greater the mass of the object being accelerated, the greater amount of force needed to accelerate the object. For instance, if I kick this football, it's gonna need less force than if I kick that trash can, okay? So, I wanna compare this bat to a roundhouse kick. If I take this bat and this ball, I'm gonna be using what in baseball is known as a sweet spot, which is this part here. This is the part that when you hit at the right time, the right moment, you make a home run. What happens if I hit with this part of the, the baseball bat? Basically, based on the second Newton law, which is force is mass by acceleration equal mass by acceleration. If I need to block that kick, throw me that, throw me that kick, and I block the kick here, I will need a lot of mass to be able to block that kick because that is the sweet spot compared to a baseball bat. When you hit, when you hit the baseball bat with the sweet spot, that's what produces the home run. But what happens when you hit the ball with this part of the bat? Nothing, because the acceleration is here. So the mass that you need to stop a bat will be here, the same as with a kick. So if he throws a kick from a kick and I block it here, nothing is gonna happen because I know that he didn't throw that, that kick with full force, but I'm able to block the kick with the palm of my hand because I'm going in, so he's using the sweet spot, boy, because that's not the strong part of the kick. So when you see me blocking a kick with, with the palm of the hand, that's why. It's, that's based on physics, that has an explanation. If I will stop the kick from making to a face, here, most likely he's gonna break my wrist. In this case, I'm applying a physics law to block the kicks, and that way I'm Closing the gap, so throw me the kick to your face. So if I am here, he lost the balance. I'm, I am already on like in the center line for whatever I want to do a takedown, a punch, another technique. The same principle is applied when throw me a kick and I go in this way. I am not using all the force that I will be using to block a kick if I do an hour outside block. So basically, everything is based on facing. The second law gives us an exact relationship between force, mass, and acceleration and can be expressed on mathematical equation. Force equals mass by acceleration. Everybody unconsciously knows what the second law is. Everybody knows that a heavier object requires much more force to travel the same distance as a lighter object. So basically, that's why I'm able to block kicks with the palm of my hands because I am not blocking the kick with the forces. I'm blocking the kick on the inside. Okay? Thank you for everything.